Shannon, have you ever seen anything like this? Never in all my life. Skip, you know I grew up on a farm. Mm -hmm. So I've seen, had, you know, my grandfather had hogs, we had chickens. Uh, I was in 4-H. I went to a county fair, a goat show, and a cow show. And I've never seen or heard bleat like this before in my life. Mm. Never. Now, I've seen guys quit in training camp, Skip. Guys have been, you know, 12, 13, 14 plus years. You're practicing three hours a day. The old way to pray, not now, but the old way. Yep. You, and you don't want to do it like, no. Normally, Skip, when a guy reaches this conclusion, he says, you know what? I don't want to lift this heavy ass weight anymore. Mm -hmm. I don't want to eat like I've been eating for the last 10, 15 years. Mm -hmm. I don't want to condition like what it requires me to go out there and, and compete at my absolute best. They do this in the off season. Mm -hmm. They don't do it in the heat of competition. Sure. But if you remember last year, Skip, Misha Tate sat right there. Mm -hmm. And she said, you know what? It came to me in the middle of the fight that I was done. She said, I hate it that it happened that time, mm -hmm. but I had to keep fighting or I could have seriously been hurt. Yep. Vontae Davis, I commend him, Skip, because we said, you know what, man, that guy's just stealing money. And I know some other guys that have quit. They quit mentally, but they still showed up physically. He was in a place that he says, you know what, I don't want to do it anymore. Mm -hmm. Now, Buffalo said, I wish you had told me that earlier. Skip, he didn't just come to this realization yesterday. If you remember, Andy Cuddy, was it last year? Mm hmm so this was here, you know, this was brewing. Mm -hmm. Now, maybe he's like, if you watch the footage of it, the, the Chargers were scoring touchdowns. There's not a Buffalo defender in sight. So Vontae Davidson said, hell, a lot of you guys retired. <laughs> Are you seeing what I'm seeing? I'm just mad enough to walk away from it. And Skip, when you get to this point in time when I was talking about this last night, when you reach this point, you know what you do? You walk into the locker room. You, put your, you throw your uniform in the middle of the clothes. You take a shower, you get dressed, you look around because you realize I'm never coming back in another locker room again. Mm -hmm. You do some out. Correct. I've never, Skip, I've never, ne see, I, when, it, when I heard it, I like, you know, I'm reading Twitter, it's coming up on the thing, it's coming like Vontae Davis, you know, retires. I'm like, how did you retire? How you retire during the game? I mean, you know, Skip, I've never, ever heard, and I've heard, listen, I've shared some stories and I've heard some stories. But this is, might be one of the strangest stories mm -hmm. in my 14 years of playing and being around it for another 15 years that I've ever heard in all my life. Mm. So I'm with you on this. I have zero use for and zero respect for Vontae Davis saying no moss at halftime. <laughs> if you wanted to do it after the game, if you wanted to do it today, I'm fine with that. Because this was predictable to me if you look at his recent history. I don't think his mind or his body was into what was going on on the football field yesterday, yes. and he knew it just like Misha Tate said she knew it. <laughs> so let's look quickly back at his career. He was the 25th pick in the first round for the Miami Dolphins, and he was basically a bust in Miami. Yes. And they traded him to Indy, and he sort of found himself. He's found a second home and a second life mm -hmm. in Indianapolis. And in 2014 and 2015, he made the Pro Bowl. Yeah. And he got his money. Mm -hmm. He got $20 million guaranteed. He has made $54 million yes. for his career. But right on schedule last year, he tears his groin early in the year. He says he needs surgery, which he did. So he had surgery. And Indy said, we are out. Right. We are done. And we cut you at the end of the year. And I'm pretty sure he's thinking, am I done yet? Like, is this it? But Buffalo calls and says, hey, we'll give you $2 million more. And on top of the $2 million guaranteed, we'll give you $50,000 a game that you make the 46-man right. roster. So he's thinking, oh, I don't know, it's pretty easy money, right? And they gave 1.5 to sign yeah. and $2 million right. fully guaranteed yeah. at his base salary. Right. All right. That's three so, and a half mil. Okay. So he's saying, this is just like easy he money, right? Stealing. Like stealing yeah. money. Yeah. But you still have to actually play football. Right. Mm -hmm. So what happened in OTAs? He was not ready to play yet. He was not healthy coming off his surgery. What happened in training camp? He could not play. Mm -hmm. What happened in the season opener this year, the first game? Mm -hmm. He was inactive. Right. And what happened right on schedule? Buffalo, probably the worst team in the league. Right. They have so many injuries at corner and they safety. They had to play him. They had to play him. And not only did they have to suit him, they had to start him. And what happens right away in that game? You saw it. Yes. Mike Williams gets wide open and victimizes this guy, Vontae Davis. Yes. The former Pro Bowler is ashamed that he's just getting lit up because yes. – he just doesn't want to play anymore. No, he doesn't want it. Okay? So he should have stopped, but he's trying to steal the money. Yeah. And guess what? 
He, they, they yank him after the, the first touchdown pass. It was a 7 to nothing touchdown pass to Mike right. Williams. They yank him, and they bench him. And he's saying, what do I need this for? Right. And I'm sure he's overreacting. And I, from his post, his, his Instagram post or whatever, it, it looked like he was kind of trying to apologize between the lines by saying, I, I sh-, you know, he, yeah. he never yeah. said I shouldn't have done this. But he said, he's basically just telling you, this is not I'm how shot. I, this, yeah. is not, and this is yeah. not how I envision my retirement. No. Sure. And he's a, as you mentioned, Skip, he's a shot fighter. But yeah. when somebody says, okay, here's $1.5 million, we'll guarantee you $2 million, and every, every game that you're on the roster, you'll get $50,000 in incentive, plus you're a, a veteran player. So that yeah. so he could have made, what, $5 million this year alone. Right. But come on, bro. No. You, I don't care what they do. It this you way. do all, not all get... You, all no. he had to do, all he had to do is come back out and stand on the sidelines yes. for the whole second yes. half. Yes! Right? That's all he had to and do. And it's over. Right. Right? No, and then go in this, and, and go in Monday... And say, Coach, I ain't got it no more. He said, I appreciate everything. He said, I appreciate you guys giving me an opportunity and believing in me. Mm-hmm. But, Coach, mentally, I'm not here. Physically, I just can't do it anymore. Yep. And now you have some dignity. Man, how you look at that man? And they, people ask me, well, what were you saying? I wouldn't have said anything. I might have had to whip him because we get whipped. Up. Buffalo are the best team. I'm like, man, get on up out of here. Yeah. Because, first of all, you, you, uh, you've been pretending all this time because I can assure you, there have probably been some of his teammates going to the coach. Hey, man, we need to give Vontae a look. Yeah. Man, put Vontae yeah, in there. Sure. He can't be no worse. Uh-huh. So now I'm vouching for you. You got my credibility, and then you pull this bull jive. That's correct. Man, kick rock. Get out of here. So several of his veteran teammates were real edgy. You should be. They they creamed him out. Yeah. They should have, because I can't defend any of this. No, 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 no. But no. I do get it. Yeah. I do see it. I do feel what he was feeling. He's a former pro bowler who was humiliated to right. even step on the field and get torched by Mike Williams. Right. And he says, I can't. He, he also did not want to associate with the mess that is now right. the Buffalo Bills starting Josh Allen, a quarterback who struggled. I think he had like a 14 QBR. Yeah, yesterday. and Oof. it's not, it's not no. going to get any better. But that's the thing, Skip. Normally, like, like I said, you've made it the hard part. Think about it. You, you've conditioned all season. You've eaten, had to eat a certain way. You had to do certain things. You go to, through training camp. Skip, the hard part is over. They don't practice hard anymore in, mm-hmm. in, in, in the regular season. Basically, it's a lot of walkthroughs. You do a little minimal work, and yep. then you go play the game. Hmm. So it's not like it's, it's, it's strenuous like it used to be. Hey, but what did you tell me? You hit this wall at yeah. one point yeah. where you just said, I can't take the meetings anymore. That, Skip, right? that's what it was. Right. Skip, I still enjoy training. Yeah. I still enjoy yeah. eating that way. I still yeah. enjoy conditioning. It was just the meetings. Hmm. And, if, and, and I, I believe if Mike would have told me, say, well, Shannon, you don't have to do meetings. <laughs> I believe I would have turned. I believe I would have turned the CBS deal down okay. because I still love the Mike place. Would not have told. No, you he that. wouldn't have told me that. No. So I had to tell him I had to go. Yep. If I would go to meetings, I would go to meetings somewhere. I would be happy. Well, somewhere <laughs> Vontae's collecting his last Three. check. You know, like he's he's good. No, nah, I'm hold on to it. I would say no. I'm. You got to sue me. Yeah. Go to the Players Association mm-hmm. and sue me to get it because <laughs> you didn't fulfill your obligation. I ain't giving you jack. Mm-hmm. And as a matter of fact, I'm coming to get some of that signing bonus back. They might. You ain't no might. They just might. How you think you gonna quit on me and then keep my money? I wish I might. Man, I wish I might think you mm-hmm. think you're gonna keep my money. Mm-hmm. I'm going to get it. I have a feeling he's gonna wake up and hey, think, mm-hmm. I should have maybe handled that a bit differently. Yeah, yeah. You, hey, you know what? Maybe a bit differently. If he they bench him, just go stand on the sidelines. But you know what, Skip? Now that I think about it, going home. Mm-hmm. Your mind's not there, your yeah. heart's not into it. Done. Don't listen, don't waste your time, and more importantly, don't waste mine. Because my time is more important than yours. I know your heart's not in it. You've already mm-hmm. keep it moving. Okay. So I'm gonna give him credit. It, it was it's bull job the way he did it, Skip, because mm-hmm. he could have handled it a better way. But we always tell guys, don't just steal money, don't just collect the check. Go on home if your heart's not in it. Mm-hmm. His heart wasn't in it. He went home. Mm-hmm. He just handled it in a bull job manner. Mm-hmm. All right, guys, don't quit on that me today joke. because we got plenty I got, more hey, to Skip get Mayler. to. Hey, <laughs> We're I going feel back I can't to Dak you. Prescott. Did he quiet all the haters last no, night? Stay no, around for this no, one, No, no, there are more of them. We'll discuss that there with Angela Hall next.